when a reconnaissance plane is about to land. A pilot in a sports car must pursue it at full speed on the ground. Otherwise, a serious accident could occur. Why? Unlike conventional water bomber, the American U-2 reconnaissance plane can fly at an altitude of 20,000 meters to gather intelligence. What distinguishes this aircraft from all others in the world is its wingspan of approximately 32 meters. This immense wing, combined with an extremely slender fuselage, allows the U-2 to fly for hours. However, such a long fuselage makes it impossible to install a conventional landing gear. The U-2 can only use a landing gear similar to that of a bicycle. It has only two pairs of struts under the fuselage, which makes landing extremely difficult. Even worse, to survive in flight, the pilot must wear a spacesuit. This significantly reduces his visibility. To avoid any accident, another U-2 pilot in a high-speed pursuit vehicle approached the aircraft and radioed its altitude to the pilot, then moved to accurately assess its position and speed. Thanks to the high efficiency of its wings, the U-2 experienced strong ground effect during landing. The pilot almost had to force the aircraft to touch down on the runway. Fortunately, the ground support pilot corrected the information in time to help the captain ensure the safety of this perilous landing.